Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be showing you what I believe actually to be the best toolkit for anyone who flies drones. This has almost everything you need in here and I took it out to the field twice already and I had I didn't I usually take a bunch of tools that I really need and just you know just be afraid that I'm going to miss anything. You know I take one of these, I take one of these, I take my hex which are these. These are very awesome by the way and um you know sometimes you do tend to forget some things but you know recently i've just put this in the bag and all i've been reaching for is this so let's just take a look at this this was on the unboxing so everything in here almost everything is supposedly titanium coated so let's take a look at what it comes with obviously it comes with a nice very it's very good quality carrying case here and let's start with the bottom here so you get these here you don't really need these for what we're doing right now but you could use them for whatever you want anyways so you get scissors the scissors are good that's a huge plus i use them you get a cutter for example when you're setting up your zip tie on your, your gopro mount or something these work absolutely great so i don't have to take cutters anymore and you also get you know some pliers and what are these good for these are when i'm trying to pull a battery strap through a hole in the frame and uh, other things also and you get a magnetic case, so you can just put this down and throw your magnets here so you don't lose them. So that is just awesome, just this part right here. Let's jump to that side, because that side is the awesome side. Let's go ahead and jump there. So what do you get here? Well, here we get two sized Phillips screws, which is the cross. We get two of them. And we get two normal flatheads. We get two of them, the titanium coated. They seem of good quality. So these were good when I was, you know, trying to tighten up my camera and loosen my camera, the Phillips right here. Now it also comes with the hex and it also comes with the sockets. So the hex comes from 1.5 to 3 millimeter. So it's 1.5 millimeter, 2 millimeter, 2.5 millimeter, and 3 millimeter. Now what we usually tend to use in this hobby is no more than 2.5 millimeter. So 1.5 millimeter, I think this is it. Is this? Yes. This is the 1.5 millimeter here, it's titanium coated, and this could be removed also if you wanted to replace this head for something else. So you could totally do that, which is pretty cool, and I really do like that. So it's very like modular in a way. So it's very nice quality, as you can tell. Hopefully the camera is doing it justice here, and they do tell you the size right there, so you don't have to worry. So the 1.5 is for micros, such as you know little 20 by 20 M2 micro standoffs, as well as you know your propellers for your micros. This is all you'll be using using for the micros, which is super cool. And some cameras do use this, so that's awesome. So that's one thing down. Now you also get the two millimeter, which is almost the standard for all, every single quad, five inch and even sometimes two inch. So this is a two millimeter that you know you put every kind of screw with, and they are good quality. I did tighten this frame down with it, and that's how I knew they were good. Look at that, uh, not even one strip, and they're titanium coated. Hopefully, it seems like it, and they're just very good. So this is the M2 type. There's also 2.5 millimeter which is some motors do give you those types of size uh, for your motors, you know, the motor screws, some give you 2.5, some give you two. So you also have that in, you also have three millimeter, which I haven't used for anything other than my CNC machine. Now they also give you these, and these are awesome, why? Because this is exactly the same size for your motor. And uh, you can just go ahead and tighten it. And if you, if you just couldn't, you know what's so cool about this, check this out, put that through, and then you could just add extra leverage. How awesome is that? That's just insanely good. Um, so, you know, this toolkit is just, it's, it's a lifesaver because the other day I forgot some things and I took this kit with me. And to be honest, this kit has everything I needed more. As long as I open it, I just check everything's in its place. That's it. I know I'm good to go and I just head out with it. And it's a, it, it keeps, you know, size and weight and everything down by a lot. So I really, really do really love this kit, like insanely love this kit. I'm very happy that I actually got it. Now, some of the things that you can do, for example, here, let's just see, I think it's this one here. Uh, you know, the M2 standoffs, for some reason, uh, let's just say it was a pain, because those are a pain for me to even tighten down. So what you can do is they even give you the exact size where you can just go ahead and spin it. But this is the wrong size. It's in there somewhere. It's this one here. So you can just go ahead. That's what I was doing yesterday with my micros. And then you can just tighten it or loosen it, you know, instead of having to, oh, or just grab, you know, pliers and then pop off a, a, a capacitor from the flight controller. So this here is a lifesaver. And um, the more I use it, the more I fall in love with it. And the more I would like to just come here and make the video and recommend it. Uh, overall quality just seems beautiful and superb, as you can tell right there. So it's, it's, it's gorgeous. It's really gorgeous, especially when you open, you just take a look at it. You know, you're doing something right. <laughs> So overall, 
uh, I think this toolkit is a must have to be honest it's, it just has everything you need you know to be honest all that it's missing is double sided tape some zip ties and what else and maybe a tweezers that's it and your portable soldering iron stick it in here and some solder and that's it you don't need anything else do you nope nothing nothing at all you know i mean you don't even need a portable soldering iron but if you wanted to you could just stick it in here which is pretty insane it's everything you need which is why i really 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 love this one i don't have to worry about anything anymore you know sometimes i forget stuff and i have to drive back 30 minutes but you know, this fits in one of the sleeves in one of my backpacks, and that's it. You know, I just know I have everything. If everything is there, then I know everything is here, and I can just head out. And um, I do, do totally recommend this so far. It's it's just been beautiful, and and um, it's good. So I keep this closed because I try to keep this only for flying so I don't lose any of them. Because I already have a bunch of these. These are also very good. If you can't afford this one, I do highly recommend these. I've had these for more than, I think, three months now. And they are just, you know, they're still sharp and uh, they're very good. I'll leave a link to these down below. I use these every single day. Every single day. Um, so these are huge plus. They come in all the sizes we need from 1.5 to 3 millimeter and everything. They're also replaceable too, as you can tell, just like the other one there. So that's pretty cool. And um, yeah, that's really, I think this kit was around 70 bucks, but I think it's totally worth it because it doesn't give you any extra bullshit. It just basically gives you everything we need in this hobby which uh, I really love and I really, really like. And I think that's it, guys. So I think that's going to include it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I just really wanted to make this video. Maybe someone would be interested in this or looking to get something. And um, it's just awesome. You know, I just put this on top of my car, take off the screws, drop them in there, know they're not going to fall or fly from the wind, and just work on what I have to work on, you know. It's, um, it's a nice little kit, like a very nice little kit like an awesome little kid and well that's it guys so i really hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, if you guys have any questions or any suggestions feel free to let me know and i will see you next time see you guys take care